so delicious. I drip some sauce, got me licking my britches. Chee chee ran, give me ceviche, friend. I be licking taco licious, vicious. Taco, 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 licious, licious, taco, licious. Oh, wow. It is a beautiful day today. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh, this is so nice. <laughs> oh, it's so nice. They got a nice light wind. It's warm. It smells good. Look at that blue sky. Oh my gosh, Shanghai. I got to tell you, it's not nearly as much pollution as usual, so thanks COVID-19. God damn, this is beautiful. Woo! I am so happy right now. It is so nice. Oh gosh. Yeah. I I I, I opened up the shades and I was like, ooh, there's a lot of there's heat coming from the window. What is that? I'm wondering why that's happening. And I went and I opened the window and a nice breeze just came in. And it smells good. It smells like summer. It smells like you know when you wake up uh, in in the afternoon. <laughs> I don't know if any of you drink. You wake up in the afternoon and you think like, oh, today's a beach day. You just feel it, you smell it, like today's a beach day. Yeah, today's a beach day. But I'm gonna have to, I'm gonna have to go to the beach in my hotel somehow. Hmm, if only there was a way. Uh, yeah, today I spent most of my time just playing music and uh, I wrote some songs. I have my buddy Tommy is down in uh, uh, Florida and he's a music producer and he said um, he could use some mandolin. He said guitar. He said some guitar stuff, but I, I said, oh, I got a mandolin, man. Hey, man, I thought you might like this. Let me see if you want to fuck with it. I'm just throwing up a random beat on GarageBand just to, to you know, supplement. Shaker goes in the sock. Yeah. Well, I think I can do better than that. Get this thing in the toe. <laughs> Let's try this. That's what's up. Yesterday, I got a lovely surprise. Um, Ryan Cordy hit me up on Facebook and said, uh, let's plan a group chat. We're all kind of doing the same thing. We're all stuck in our homes, let's do it. And uh, we were all free right then. So he calls me up and we got Chris Smith and Zoe and uh, we got Ryan and Kylie and Sam Cordy and John. And uh, it was just the loveliest. Oh, of course, and of course, Harper and, uh, and I want to say Bert. I can't remember your son's name. <laughs> Definitely not Bert, is it? What is it? Oh, I'm sorry, I can't remember your kid's name. I just I just saw him for the first time. <laughs> um, but it was great. Uh, really, just made my week. Um, we it was just all laughs and stuff. And then we and then we planned to uh, get together again soon, and uh, have like a virtual bar hang. And um, but yeah, look at look at these guys. This was so much fun. Look at uh. Yeah, all of us here. It was hard to get everyone crammed in, like, to the same tiny little four split screen. So we <laughs> had some problems here, but but yeah, everyone's doing this now, and we're all stuck, and we all want to hang out. We want to drink with our friends. So just get on a group chat. Many of you probably have already had this idea, and just hang out. It's awesome. It made me feel 
completely not isolated or quarantined. It was fantastic. So thank you guys for that. That was really lovely. Um, and I'm sure we'll do it again soon. So, uh, yeah. And another, and another quick update, uh, for those of you who haven't seen, here are a couple pictures of my awesome new hotel room, which is a serious upgrade. Although the food still sucks, the room is way better. So that's pretty cool. This, yes, this, this is dinner. I mean, uh, today's dinner was actually pretty good, but I should have left these. This is uh, from a taco place. It's a chicken asado taco, and it's so good. So good. Oh my gosh. And they're so nice there, too, on uh, this taco delicious place um, that I have told you about. Um, they gave me free chips and salsa. Really good salsa. And also, the Jameson in a discreet ginger ale bottle, ginger beer bottle. And this is really good. And then a full one, actually a full one. This was free. Then this one was free. Um, really good ginger beer. Uh, fantastic. I'm very happy right now. I'm very happy right now. In fact, I'm going to make another one of these. This is, yeah, this is a whiskey. And I didn't give like a specified amount. I just gave them um, $30. Yeah. $30 and said, just give me this much whiskey. And they gave me like an entire bottle, which is pretty nice of them. Um, whiskey, uh, foreign alcohol is expensive in China. Unfortunately, it's a little more than, it's a lot more than it would be back home. The import tax and all that. So that's too bad, but so good. Um, a little more story. Maybe you'll find it entertaining, but as I think, you know, my Chinese is not very good. And so like I, I've gotten used to, the Chinese I use is stuff that I use kind of regularly. I'm sorry, <laughs> I'm not talking. Uh, and um, so I, 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 when I order delivery from a different app, um, I know what to expect. I know when they're gonna call, what they're gonna say, and I have like a prepared response, I'm ready for it. But this was a new app because I'm outside of the delivery range. So I had to, I had to use a different service that the taco place helped me set up um, and Got it all figured out, did everything right, got the addresses correct, and, and it delivered. And the guy goes, he's downstairs and he calls me, and I think he's just saying, your delivery's here. And I'm like, cool. Uh, and I just say like, Zailo, which just means at first floor. I don't know how to say like, leave it on the first floor. I just say like, at first floor. Like, at first floor, okay. <laughs> Zailo, okay. <laughs> at first floor, okay. This is kind of a ridiculous thing to say, but hopefully he'll get it. So I was like, okay, good, good, okay, hang up. And then I call the um the front desk on the phone here and i say i have a delivery um downstairs and and she said and i because i can't say why am i it's not that i'm saying like san shang san uh shan song shan song she's like oh shan song i'm like yeah 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 shan song i'm just saying shan song the tone's different like i just the tone's off and they just don't know what i'm saying um and uh and so uh, i just i don't know beyond that what to say i'm like i don't know how to explain that the delivery guy's there and he needs to give you the stuff. And then he calls me back and I got this phone over here and I got my cell phone over here. And I'm like, I just say to both of them, I, I don't speak Chinese. And and I, they try to put the phones together. Make, okay, um, I say, Ni men shua, you, you speak, you all speak. Ni men shua. I put them on like nothing's happening. I'm like, oh, this is awful. I just spent a lot of money on this food and I, I'm not gonna get it. I don't wanna do this stuff. And finally the woman who's losing patience on the phone, pulls out her phone and does a translator. I'm trying to use the translator and then she uses a translator and she says, uh, drop off code. I'm like, oh, drop off code, cool. So I'm looking at my phone. I can't find the drop off code. I don't know how to use this app. I've never used it before. What's the code? Is it a barcode or is it a number? And so I just look through and I'm like, okay, there's a six digit number. Maybe I'll try that. And I say the six digit number. And she's like, good, okay. Hangs up the phone. Like doesn't even say bye. She just says, okay, it hangs up. So I definitely was kind of trying her patience. And that guy, I'm like, okay, that's everything's done. Good, the robot is gonna bring me my food, perfect. And then, uh, then I get a call from the delivery guy on my phone again, and he's saying something. I'm like, oh shoot, I have no idea. I thought we were done here. Mm -hmm. And then I'm like, well, he must be asking for the code. So I just said Nima, which means code. Nima, Jiu Wu Wu San Shiba, which is nine five five three seven eight. And and it, he goes, oh oh, uh, 
you Sajiba? I was like, yeah, he's like, oh, do, 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 okay. And I mean, do I means like, correct. Yeah, 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 okay. Oh, do, 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 okay, okay. Whew. And then the robot came. Oh, and the robot's disgusting. So I took, they give us these, uh, these are um, disinfectant cotton balls. Their cotton balls are soaked in rubbing alcohol. And um, that robot is gross. It is filthy. And it's a touch thing. Like you have to touch open. You have to, you can't use a napkin. It is, it, you have to use your finger. And it's disgusting. And so today I decided to clean it because no, I cannot believe we're in a quarantine facility. There's doctors and nurses downstairs. And the, the thing that everyone touches that they send to you for your and their safety is not clean. And it's like the same gross stuff. Like I, it, it was, that stuff had been caked on. I was scrubbing at it with these cotton balls that had been on there for a while. It's disgusting. I'm pretty sure I recognize some of the weird dry splotchy patterns from before though. So it's not like, it was like a dry sanitation fluid. I'm pretty unimpressed with that. That's, that is a huge oversight. And if I knew enough Chinese, I would really, really make that downstairs woman at the front desk hate me. Uh, anyway, that's, <laughs> that's my end of, video rant. Sorry if that was manic, <laughs> but I'm in quarantine, so a little bit of mania kind of comes with it. So signing off.